So sometimes people wonder, is there some way languages are all the same? And there, there is one sense in which languages are all the same, in that human beings have, we're wired to learn language. Uh, most linguists agree that we have this instinct to learn language. But the thing is, we don't have an instinct to learn a particular language. That all depends on what, where, what your context is, what your parents speak, what your neighbors speak. And so as we look around at the world's languages, 7,000 of them, you know, what do they have in common? Well, um, most linguists agree that about the only thing all languages have are nouns and verbs. And you go, but even there, uh, the order that we put them, like in English, we put our subject first, then our verb, then our object. Most Germanic languages are subject, object, verb. Some languages are verb, subject, object. So that's one of the things that children learn. In my language, what order do those come in? Um, yeah, you know, many languages are, are related to each other, like Portuguese, Spanish, Italian, French, Romanian, obviously all come from Latin. Uh, the Scandinavian languages, except for Finnish and Estonian, and then uh, all the Germanic languages, they all come from Old German, and all the Slavic languages come from Old Slavic, and then all those languages, along with Sanskrit and in India, they all came from what we've uh, posited as Proto-Indo-European. So, uh, of those 7,000 languages, it's estimated there are about 70 of these language families that are around the world. And where those 70 came from? That's a good question that linguists study.